Hi everyone. Good morning. Rachel is going to be joining us this morning and uh, excited to pray with all of you. Today, um, the feast day is the feast day of St. Martin de Porres. And everything, even sweeping, scraping vegetables, weeding a garden, and waiting on the sick could be a prayer if we were to offer it to God. Amen. Everything we do today be in prayer. Hi, good morning. Okay, Rachel, this is gonna work. It's gonna be <laughs> Amen, Father. Mary conceived without sin, pray for us who have recourse to you. <gasps> Rachel, I see you. <laughs> Yay! I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> We're so glad. Good morning. Good morning. I know the technical stuff is so stressful. I know. It properly. So. <laughs> I am too. Glad that Thank works. Thank you. I was going to go ahead and share our intentions uh, for this morning uh, from Stacy for the repose of the souls of Gracie and Emmy DeWald. Um, these two young adult siblings died suddenly as passengers in a car accident on Monday. So we pray that uh, we just pray for grace and strength for their parents and family as they struggle through this horrible loss and recover them in prayers. Um, from Mindy, um, we want to pray, pray for her two sons who have RSV, uh, just prayers for strength and healing for them. And then from Michelle, uh, for her daughter Isabella, who's suffering from scrupulosity and OCD. So prayers for complete healing and, and help and, you know, the proper care. So we want to pray for you and your family and everyone in here and all, all the intentions. Um, is there anything specific you'd like to pray for? Um, my dad was just diagnosed with oh. brain cancer a few weeks ago. So we want to pray for him. Yeah, for complete healing, um, for all the treatment. Uh, and just for continued peace. There's a lot of grace and peace when you walk through this kind of stuff. Um, but, you know, we know that's just a gift from the Lord. So we pray for more of that and for, you know, anyone else who's suffering for sure. Absolutely. All right. Well, we'll go ahead and get started. Okay. In the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born, born in the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell, and on the third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and sits at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty, from whence he shall come to judge the living and the dead. The living and the dead. Believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For an increase in the virtues of faith, hope, and charity, we pray. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit to thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Glory Amen. be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from hell. Forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. So, Rachel, they're saying that we're kind of overlapping. So, what I was going to do, I'll just pray the first mystery and respond, and then I'll let you lead and respond for the second, and we'll kind of alternate if that's okay. Okay. Yeah. That sounds good. The first luminous mystery is the baptism of our Lord. 
Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, Forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. And the second luminous mystery is the wedding feast at Cana. We pray to do whatever he tells you. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death, amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, excuse me, Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. The third luminous mystery is the proclamation of the kingdom of God. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. The fourth luminous mystery is the transfiguration. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. I was going to say, Glory. The fifth luminous mystery is the institution of the Eucharist. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, hail our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious Advocate, the eyes of mercy towards us, and after this our exile. Show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray, pray for us, O Holy Mother. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy as a promise of the Christ. O God, by your only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life. Grant, we beseech thee, that by meditating upon these mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, that we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise, through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Uh, Rachel, do you want to lead the St. Michael prayer? Do you want me to? I can do that, sure. St. Michael the Archangel, defend us in battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray, and do thou, thou, Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, cast into hell Satan and all other evil spirits who prowl about the world, Amen. seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Can you, can you, I, I can, it's kind of, okay, now I can see you. <laughs> I can't see you. Oh, no, you're fine. Oh, sorry. Um, uh, so... <laughs> I know you've you've prayed and you've spoken to my sister several times, so um, I, I know we've never like met met, but um, so I just wanted to first we always love to ask about your experience with the rosary or maybe recently how it's it's helped you in your prayer life and anything you care to share. Yeah, um, so it's it's fun. I was thinking about this. I actually just started a fifty day rosary novena with three of my very best girlfriends we've grown up together uh, i was at a wedding a few weeks ago and it's such a beautiful story the a couple who are in their late 20s early 30s and the mom of the bride had started a 50-day rosary novena for her daughter um, for to find a you know good catholic spouse and the the last day of the rosary of the 50-day novena uh day 50 um, they were at the the now husband and wife were at a young a Catholic group singles group, and that was the day he worked up the courage to ask her if he could walk her to her car at the end of the uh, the event. And I love that that was like day fifty, so they like kind of you know they kind of had met, they they knew each other, but they had not been able to kind of move it into anything else. So that was so encouraging. So we were at that wedding a couple of weeks ago, and just to celebrate God's goodness in the midst of all that. So we, uh, my friends and I started a 50-day novena. Not that any of my college friends are going to get married or anything, but I know those of us who have, you know, older kids, and even with younger kids, we just want God to pour out his grace upon them. Um, so I, you know, I just thought that was really neat that I got invited to, to pray with you in the midst of, this is like, for me, day four. Of oh, novena. wow. So we just this, started it. Do you know, um, we've heard so many times, I mean, I guess we've been so blessed uh, to hear from others and how that novena, that 50, that I think it's 54, that rosary, like. Is it 54? Yeah. Okay. I, Maybe it's 54. Uh, yeah. I, 50. <laughs> I feel like we've been on the 50, you know, we've been on the rosary novena wagon for <laughs> since like 1990. <laughs> but it, it, it really, um, yeah. it really, it, it, it is it's just incredible how Mary, you know, I feel like she just, you know, she's the most gentle guide and, and brings you so close to her son. So it's so beautiful. So I'm glad to hear that. Yes. I, I love that. Just um, every morning on the way to school, my, my kids go to a school that's like a two minute drive and we have enough time to, to hop in the car. We do the, 
St. Michael, the, we do a Hail Mary, St. Michael the Archangel, and then a prayer to our guardian angels. And I just love our faith. Like, all of those are just designed to draw us closer to Jesus. You know, it's like, keep the devil away because he distracts us and he gets in the middle of things. And Mary, guide us because you want us to love your son more. And then guardian angel, you're my special, you know, you're my special warrior. You're right next to me. And, uh, and I love that about our faith. that It, like, shows us these tools that we have um, to guide us, you know, in our so I love more. that you brought up our guardian angels because I, um, it, I love that special warrior because it's true. <laughs> and <laughs> mine sometimes goes like this, but yes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's so, um, you know, I had this crazy experience uh, a couple of years ago. One of our sons was going to um, spring break and he was going with a group of uh, other college guys that we didn't know. Um, and I was, I had a lot of anxiety about this. And uh, it just so happened that as he was about to load up to leave, my husband and I were both in the driveway at the same time. Like, I feel like God just totally orchestrated this for us. So we were standing there and, you know, we said, Charlie, can we pray over you before you go? And he's like, sure. You know, he's heading off to Florida. So we laid hands on him and we said some prayers. And God, I mean, I know this is true. Some people might say there's no way. And I know this is true that God allowed me in a split second to see Charlie's guardian angel. And it brought me so much peace. Like it was like this giant warrior. Like, you know, I think sometimes it's like, it's like a little baby with these cute little wings and it's just floating next to us. But it was this mighty warrior. And I, like I had this sense of peace come over me. Like God, he has resources that can guide and protect my children better than I can. And I think I'm the best at it, you know, and it, it was such a, a beautiful moment of grace that God it kind of just gave me that flash. Of yes. Oh, there, that's you know? beautiful. Wow. I can't imagine. What, what a grace. And then the comfort to know he's okay. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Like it just helped me kind of be able to just calm down yes, a little bit. You yes. know, which was so where, where is your your sons are do you have two in college or one? One in college. Four. Four. Uh four. Four. Well, so I, our oldest uh graduates in a couple of two semesters and then son number two just graduated and he's studying to he's hoping to go to law school next year. And then uh we have two that are like in the middle of their college journey. And then we have a five year break in between those four guys and then we have two at home still on the we have a son who's a freshman in high school and then one girl and she's in seventh grade. So we're kind of all over. Oh, wow. Like, you you know, you look so on. young. Yeah. I thought your kids were all little. I was like, Chris, you really, because <laughs> my kids are all old. <laughs> I, I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> That's beautiful. Okay. I love it. I love it. Oh, oh, you know the pit college. Oh. Um, I, I only have one in college right now, two that went through, but it's, um, yeah, it's a journey. <laughs> so it's a whole, it's a whole different kind of parenting, isn't it? It's just like, mm -hmm. yeah, everything you've been doing up till now, you have to kind of like completely switch, shift gears on it. You know, like you grow in so much trust in the Lord because it's like, you know, really that. I wrote about this yesterday on my Instagram, just like learning how to be a guide if you need, but like, it's not the same kind of parenting. And that's, I, I get tripped up a little because I still have two at home that need a certain kind of parenting. And then there are four older brothers. That's not the kind of parenting they need. And it's not good for me to try to give that kind of parenting in this season, you know, but as a mama, you know, like we, we just want the best for our kids. And so that can be, we have to learn what that looks yes, like. In yes, I, 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 that kids. surrender no, novena is one of my favorites. <laughs> that and the divine mercy. <laughs> I trust, I trust. Yes. <laughs> I would love. <laughs> yeah, uh, so totally. Yeah. You, okay. You are coming out. Is this out? No such thing as ordinary unlocking your extraordinary life through everyday encounters with Jesus. Yes, that came out in May okay. through Ovid okay. Press. Yeah. So it's available but, on Amazon now. Yes. And on How Ovid do you Press. find time to write? Well, I think I think because I love to write, um, like I as a writer have that real urge oh. to purge, so to speak. Like I have stuff here 
that I like feel compelled to share. And I think, you know, um, that must be like the motivating thing. And it, it is kind of like after I write, I get that sense of relief of like, you know, that feeling when you yes. use the gifts that God has given you and you can tell that you've done something um, that that's how I, I feel after I write. But no, I have to like feel a way like I don't have like the day just unfolds before me and I just have all this quiet time. You know, when I was writing that book, I actually had several Saturday mornings in a row where I would go to my office. I teach um, at the university uh, in town and I would go just get up before any of the rest of my family was awake. Let my husband know the night before, like I'm going to get up early and sneak out and just go like wouldn't even shower or anything, just run, race up there and lock myself in my office for a few hours. And I did that several times. And uh, that, you know, like just sort of like chipping away at it. But having a plan, like when people ask, like, how do you write? I, you know, like if you want to know how to write, you, it's really all about your yes. behind being in a chair, <laughs> sitting down and then starting to put words yes. on paper. You yes. know, or on the what inspired you to write this book? Do you want to tell us a little bit about it? Yeah, um, so this book was really just about uh, the journey of, of God helping me discover my identity in him. Um, you know, as a mama, I, like being a mom, and I love that in our faith we say, you know, we recognize it's a vocation. It's the thing that we're, that God is using to draw us closer to him, and we build the church through, you know, our, the vocation of motherhood. But when that starts to change or when we lean too much into that being our identity, right, um, that, that we really limit how we see mm -hmm. ourselves and what God can do for us um, or what we allow God to do. I, you know, just kind of that whole journey of like as things shifted for me as my kids got older and I realized that a lot of my identity came from being a mama, you know, showing up to a store with a big pack of kids, um, really thinking that like my worth came from the things that I did. And so kind of learning in different journeys, different seasons of motherhood even like, when our sixth child came, our surprise daughter, after all these boys, um, all of a sudden, like, I could not keep up with my life anymore. And for so long, I had prided myself on, like, I'm a stay-at-home mom. You know, at that point, I was a stay-at-home mom. So it was like, I wasn't trying to work outside the home. I, you know, I was a freelance writer. Mm -hmm. I did a lot of other things. But um, the, I, all of a sudden, I had a newborn and a toddler and then four boys that were, like, in middle school and, or, you know, elementary and middle right. school. I was exhausted, you know, um, and I know a lot yes. of moms can relate to that. And, and all of a sudden it was like, I can't do all the things that I used to be able to do, be the room mom, go on the field trip, show up for every basketball game, you know, and just kind of all of a sudden recognizing, whoa, like mm -hmm. my sense of self-worth had come for a long time from the stuff I was showing up for and saying yes to, and that's not how it's supposed to be. So just kind of like learning that, like, and then a lot of the book focuses on the woman at the well. And I love that story in John because Jesus meets the woman where she is in the middle of her daily life, right? And I think for so many of us, we think that a deeper connection with God is going to be in a season when we're less busy or when we have it more together. And, and Jesus really is like, I am here waiting for you in the midst of all that you already have going on. Like, you don't need to escape your regular life to find me. Now, pockets of quiet are certainly helpful um, and good, but, you know, that Jesus is already waiting for us right here, and, um, and it's such a beautiful That is, uh, <laughs> I hope I didn't lose. Yes, that's so, I think we all needed to hear that. <laughs> so thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> Because, um, well, for me, especially my, my youngest is going to be graduating high school and I just, I'm scared to death. I, I, I'm not scared, but it's like this for 20 some years, you've been, um, kind of, you know, that's been your, your, they're your life. Well, not your, I don't know. That sounds, but it's, it, it is a, it's something that I've been praying or, or trying to work through. And then, um, and then even like for my sister, she is like in the midst of constant, you know, like there's just so much coming at her all the time. So I think um, she too feels that like uh, struggle, you know, of, of showing up and, and um, but then I need Jesus and all. <laughs> so thank you. <laughs> yeah, like and, and really recognizing like the thing that we're doing right now is the thing that mm -hmm. God is asking us to do, right? 
Um, but then all of a sudden when that shifts a little, like for you, as your youngest is about to graduate and I'm kind of in that, not quite the same, but, but like, you know, we always had this like path of boys. Well, when you have a lot of kids close, that's awesome. But then you experience a lot of things at the same time, like graduations mm -hmm. were like, you know, four and five years, all of a sudden, oh, they're all gone, you know, and then there's this big shift. And so it's really being willing to always say like, okay, God, what is the next thing that you're asking of me? And sometimes that's going to look like retreat and a totally different, you know, it's just going to look totally different. Um, and just kind of learning to operate, I think, in a moment by moment, like, so, and uh, it's funny that, you know, Kristen's going through that. My sister, Joanna, is in the same boat. Like, when I was in that drowning season, she was off doing study abroad on the French Riviera. <laughs> she was at you parties. Know, and like, all of a sudden now, <laughs> I know, she was like in Austria for, with Steubenville, and I'm like drowning in life, and it was beautiful, but now all of a sudden it's like, my mobility is totally different and she has all these little boys mm -hmm. and it's life is crazy you know whatever the thing is that god is asking each one of us in the season and i really went through several years where i lived on a on a three minute by three minute schedule like i can do anything mm -hmm. for the next three minutes you know like like life just can be really with little kids especially life can be really intense and hard and now with big kids it's a different kind of um like, yeah, trust in the divine yes. mercy yeah. kind of a thing, you know, and, and, and I love that God uses all of those things for our sanctification to help us yes. learn to rely on him. And then getting back to Mary, like the blessed mother, just, she's there to, to guide us closer to her such son. A gift. And, such I a think, gift. and um, what we keep trying to remind each other of is, you know, enjoying this moment, being deeply aware in this moment um, of God's presence and love and gratitude and, you know, trying not to miss life you know in that um so <laughs> but it is hard <laughs> it's interesting all the seasons you know you do go yeah. through and 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 now looking back i feel like i'm you know you, you really appreciate i you know try to remind that it's it's so beautiful it's um and, and it's so hard <laughs> but uh yeah 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 it just expands yeah. your heart the whole time <laughs> yeah. absolutely it is it's it is wonderful and you know, there are moments where you're like, I can't do this. And then they're, you know, then all of a sudden, yeah. you like see God's grace and, you know, the highs, I like to yes, say, the highs, the highs, yes, they are. <laughs> <laughs> but you also host a show, like, right? Yeah. So, and that's so fun. So I'm a co, a co host of The Gist on Catholic TV with um, mm -hmm. Danielle Dean and Carolee McGrath. And I love getting to do that. And it, the way that works, is I fly so the both of those ladies uh Carolee lives up in near Boston and Danielle is in New Hampshire and then I'm here in Georgia so I fly up to Boston and it's one time a year and we're there for a whole week and we film a whole season and so we spend the week interviewing people um having roundtable discussions oh, that would be um, so it's just so it's so cool I've learned so much you know yeah and then in post production the show gets put together and now we're in the thick of it now we're rolling out new episodes. Uh, I think they come out on Tuesdays or Wednesdays on uh, Catholic TV. So that's been so wonderful because um, I do have a journalism background, but I never, I was always print like a newspaper girl. And uh, so it's been fun to kind of use that, those journalism skills to in do interviews and talk. Yeah. yeah but that's amazing. That would be really so cool. fun. <laughs> Especially like, cause I imagine you meet a lot of <laughs> wonderful people and like even just hanging out with the co-hosts and, and talking. Yeah. It's a, it yeah. is an Do you have a favorite? Blast. Yeah. Do you so have um, a favorite discussion or topic or any? The, the thing that I love about the show is really just that we are talking about things because that we are talking mm -hmm. about things that we care about. And so I think, and then we all kind of have our own lives. Like, I mean, in real life, we have become friends, but it's not like we knew each other before. Um, really, like Danielle and I had met through social Catholic social media circles, like back in the day, um, but that we're talking about what's on the hearts and minds, I think, of Catholic women and who want to be saints. We want to grow in holiness. And what does that look like? Sometimes, you know, we talk about spiritual things, sometimes practical things, but always mm -hmm. through the lens of our faith. Um, and, and I just absolutely love that. You know, that's how we're all yes. trying to live our lives. Um, and so it's a real yes, joy to get yeah, to discuss absolutely. that. Absolutely. And then provide that's the beauty I've I've found 
just through speaking with various people, um, just how they share their perspective and we all learn so much. It's, it's wonderful. Yeah. 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 Well, thank you. Yeah. Thank you so much for enduring and, and praying with us. And it was so nice to, to talk with you. And yeah, thank you. Oh, I'm so grateful. Yeah, the whole and I'll say one last thing, uh, because I think the whole way that this got started, I, I was, I did have done the road so, yes. with your sister, I think. Um, but it's been a little while. But I posted something on uh, Instagram <laughs> stories not that long ago, a memory that I had when our daughter Isabel was two, we were at the pool one summer. And she was in the baby pool. So she could have been younger than two. And she looked like she had like a brown, like a black crusty thing in her nose. And I was like, great, you know, let me get that thing out of your nose. And I reached in to pull it out. It was four rosary beads that she had shoved up her nose. Four Hail Marys. Well, that's one way to do it. <laughs> and I pulled it. Like, where did this come from? I just was like, I have the you do. Catholic toddler at the whole She's thing like today. covering everyone. <laughs> <laughs> so that cracked me up. I know, just storing a rosary. So anyway, it was such a delight to be here with thank you today and keep up the good work. Um, just, it's oh, such a thank blessing you, to thank so you. many. We just praise here. God. Thank you. So. We'll have a wonderful day. <laughs> Bye. Thanks. You too. God bless.